Welcome to Fire Sale, the podcast. I'm Carrie Lynn, the debut author of Fire Sale, y'all, a trauma response in poetry and prose. This podcast is all about raw truth, self-publishing, survival, and healing through the tough stuff. Because no matter how much the world tries to snuff out your creativity, it's still in there waiting for a spark. And that's what we're here to do, light it up. So let's dive in. Today I'm diving into the heart of Fire Sale, y'all, my debut poetry book. It's my first poetry book, my debut collection of poetry. I'm going to talk about how I titled the book, the structure of the chapters, and the inspiration behind it all. <laughs> Last episode, I introduced myself. We talked about my background, the reason that I wanted to start up this podcast, and sort of the journey that I've experienced up to this point in my life. I had three or four different titles in mind, and Fire Sale Y'all was one of them. Another was my first orgasm and other things that happened in my 40s. <laughs> I love that one. I wanted that one so bad. But I, when I was talking to my friends and, of course, my family about that one, my mom was like, you can't. There's no way. And, and then I, uh, the other, oh, the other one. There was three. So there was Fire Sale Y'all. A trauma response in poetry and prose. There was my first orgasm and other things that happened in my 40s. And then there was evening tea. I don't think a single person voted for fire sale or voted for fire sale, y'all. When I kind of put it out there and was like, what do you think? And what do you think? And no one was like, ooh, fire sale, y'all. But I really wanted that one. I really wanted that. I felt like it was a brand opportunity for me and I'm in sales. I'm an author, right? But what's paying my bills or has been paying my bills for a while is sales. And so in my mind, I was just like, man, fire sale, y'all. Just the word y'all, you know, you all, that country Southern word, that's me. And I've been in this process of claiming my own identity. And that's, I think, was why I went with Fire Sale, y'all. Because I'm like, this is my identity. I'm claiming it right now. I'm a, I'm a freaking Kentucky hillbilly who sold all her shit. <laughs> it was like, peace out, y'all. That's me. Like, I just, I really, I drew a line in the sand for myself. And I'm really glad that I did because y'all is a key part of my identity. Now, the identity that I have claimed, not an identity that I developed to adapt to the situation to survive. This is an identity I chose. And then through this self-discovery, path that I've been on, I reclaimed that. I reclaimed my roots. And so for me, Fire Cell Y'all is part of that. Um, so the reason that I named the chapters after the stages of fire became, it just became necessary after I chose Fire Cell Y'all. Because once I had those piles of the, what were going to be the chapters, right? The early childhood, the early relationships, and now I'm married to now I'm divorced. I was like, wow, is this not the actual stages of fire? And those stages are what I, I titled the chapters by. So we've got incipient, incipient, which is, which is a fucking amazing word. Anyway, and I like words. I'm a freaking geek. Incipient is 
just the the environment being ripe for fire there's a spark or something that occurs and then boom there's you know growth there's a fire and then the third stage is fully developed that is when the fire is full on raging and there's a flashover point within the fully developed stage of fire development which i i didn't title a chapter called the flashover but in the arc of fire sale y'all the book the flashover is the arc right that's the moment where it's like holy shit he's been banging other chicks this whole time right that's what in my mind that's what was happening and then like just all hell broke loose so that's the arc and the poems and the stories that all surround that are within within that fully developed stage and then the final stage is called decay and i had to make a note in the book to help people understand that decay is a, a when you think of decay it's not there's not good feelings there but in the stages of fire development the fire is done right that's the that's the end point and so for me decay is this stage of rebirth of renewal and that's where i close out the book <clears throat> is in that stage and then you know i end the book with what i call a letter to self and I won't reveal what is in that. You'll have to wait and read it in the book. And I'm really excited about sharing that with you. And in fact, I am going to be doing a poetry reading today of a piece that I think is completely relevant to what we've been talking about. So this poem is called Breathing. Why am I crying? I'm crying because breathing hurts. The oxygen burns. I have been deprived of air for so very long. I have been strangled by my family, by my men, by myself for most of my life. For the first time, I am breathing and it hurts. It really hurts. And I couldn't be more exhilarated by the experience. So, <laughs> that poem is just a glimpse into the emotions that are captured in my debut collection, Fire Cell, y'all. I cannot wait for you to experience the rest. I really can't. So, next time... I'll be talking about uh, more of the publishing process, the publishing world. It feels like a whole world, a whole universe. I really hope that you like this episode and I really hope you stay tuned for the next one. Please, you know, subscribe to my podcast. <laughs> Lipstick sucks. I shouldn't be bitching. I mean, I'm bitching. Woo! Yeah, I'm a bitching chick, but like I'm bitching, you know, like complaining. <laughs> I'm so old. Uh, I'm gonna put on. I'm gonna put on my eyes so I can read a poem for you. <laughs> that was exhilarating. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even drinking. Like, I totally plan. Maybe I'll do it in the next episode. Maybe I'll drink a Guinness or some wine or something. 
<laughs> but <laughs> this is just me not on drugs. <laughs> Hey, y'all, buy my book. It's cold. I can't afford to turn the heat on. <laughs> I'm listening. I'm getting the kids the giggles. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna turn the camera off and <laughs> start over. <laughs> oh god. I don't wanna have to redo my eyeliner. <sighs> okay. I'm good. I'm straight. I'm so straight. Thanks for tuning in to Fire Sale where we don't hold back. If you're ready for more and want to be the first to know when Fire Sale Y'all drops, join my readers list at www.whoiscarrylynn.com. You can also hit me up on Facebook or Instagram at whoiscarrylynn or drop me a line through the contact form on my website. Stay bold and I'll catch you next time. Later, y'all.